yes my boys in order to get through we're gonna open up some dank Yu-Gi-Oh packs today so like kind of following up from like last time we did this I opened up some packs uh, or I opened up some cards from a box from MJ Holding Company. Basically, these are the same exact things. These things all come from that MJ Holding Company place. And basically, I have no idea what to expect coming out of these packs. These individual ones here, no idea what to expect. This one here uh, is brand new, so I don't know. Will we get the new suck out of this pack? I don't know. It's, apparently, there's like a new uh suck in this pack that the tcg people are going nuts for right now so it'll be interesting to see if we pull something out of here but before we go in here since this is our like centerpiece uh we're gonna do this last and so we're gonna put that aside and then let's just open up a pack of this invasion of chaos first because that's ridiculous back in the day. Who remembers Invasion of Chaos? I'm saving the Legend of Blue Eyes because I wanna open up my dank Exodia piece or my dank LOB Blue Eyes. I wanna pull it out, pull it out uh, coming last. I'm about to destroy the value of these Ancient Illusion packs anyway. If I can get into it, shit. Like, can you, like, like who gets into these packs? Now, I didn't mention before, this pack includes a booster pack, two rares, uh, and eight commons. And, and I don't know from what sets they draw them from, but we're gonna we're gonna find out right now. So there's a Miss Valley dude right on top, so that's all, all always a terrible sign. So here's a Miss Valley guy, tuning, uh, fire fist dude. Uh, I can't even read this up. I guess these are just random comments from all kinds of different sets. Yeah, has to be. Because I have never seen most of these. So, these are just random comments that they had lying around. Nothing wrong with random comments. We'll, we'll take your random comments. Thank you. But now let's get into this pack. Now, this is pretty interesting. It's a freaking uh, Invasion of Chaos pack. I haven't seen these in years. But super curious to see what's gonna come out of this and plus I don't know if this is um, like a legit old pack or is it like a remade old pack I don't know but we're gonna find out right now get out of the way comments all right we're gonna do the whole special dank reveal here all right so spread out the cards let's start flipping them okay invasion of chaos flips Flipping this card first. <laughs> Chaos Necromancer. So I guess I'll flip it the other way. <laughs> flip it like this. Chaos End. <laughs> well, no, that's not going to work because it's still upside down for you. You got to flip it like this. Got to flip it like, like that. Right? Yeah. Terror King Salmon. Okay. Another another dank common. <laughs> where, where is our rare? Come on. Nope, nowhere. Where's this? Sp sp spatial collapse. <laughs> oh, there's our rare. Sasuke Samurai number three, L. So that's nothing in this pack. Nothing now. Nothing. Be gone, knave. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm doing with this pack. A hero emerges. Multiplication ants. Jade Insect Whistle. Wow, Jade Insect Whistle was Invasion of Chaos. And this is... Yeah, these... I don't think these are uh, reprints. I think these are just old school Invasion of Chaos cards. So, that's pretty interesting. We got this dank little set of cards from Invasion of Chaos. Jade Insect Whistle. That's actually pretty dang cool to actually get a real one of those. Since we one of those dank links players. Jade Insect Whistle, pretty nice. So, Invasion of Chaos, you didn't 100% fail me yet. You failed me. All right, so let's let's go hop into another Invasion of Chaos and crack open this pack and see what's going on in here. Ah, again, it's super hard to get into. It's like they, they really, I guess, wanna make sure that no one steals these things. So it's not hard to just kind of punch in and just pull stuff out. 
already see at the top we got a wind up joint and with our invasion of chaos pack i like opening up these blisters <laughs> and i know you probably heard me just tossing those casually behind me but you know trust me i tossed them in a very uh environmentally safe area just believe me <laughs> so let me see let's take a look at this this wind up beast oh we got two uh two rares of black what is this velo velo -C. velo -C. and then everything else is just commons i believe yeah we got two of those oh dimensional prison that's a common now god damn <laughs> and an old school first edition ojama yellow I forgot to turn that off. And an old school Ojama yellow. That's kind of it's kind of nuts. You got an old school Ojama yellow, but uh, but yeah, I'm surprised that they even have cards like Invasion of Chaos and uh, things like that as comments. Well, I'm not too surprised seeing all the new stuff that came out uh, recently and seeing how powerful the cards are now and all the different type of summoning mechanics. Yeah, that's that's probably. A good idea to make something like that a comment. All right, so let's crack open this pack, Invasion of Chaos. Hopefully we can pull our Black Lesser Soldier or our Chaos Emperor Dragon or a Dank Demok. That'd be great if we can pull any of those. So I'll put them all face down, shuffle them up so we can get that mystery pool. Look at me destroying the value right now. Look at this, all right. So let's start flipping them. Get mystery pulls. Mystery flip. Bam. <laughs> Ojama Black. <laughs> I swear that I do not remember these Ojama cards being an in Invasion of Chaos. I really don't remember that at all. But I guess they were. Um, I guess they were. Because this guy here is an Ojama Yellow from Invasion of Chaos First Edition. That's the first edition Ojama Yellow. So I don't know. I, I just don't remember Ojama cards being in Invasion of Chaos. But, you know, I guess they were. All right, another flip. Soul Absorption. Nothing. Another flip. <laughs> what? What is this? Grand. 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 Oh, Grandora? <laughs> yeah, not what we wanted or needed. Ryu Koki. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good. But not what we wanted. Uh, leap what chops chop man the desperate outlaw <laughs> chop man the desperate outlaw my voice get get him out of here Philip uh, Philip who stealth bird now add this to dual links people are gonna just quit the game this card you flip it you can put it face down like you know like a, a, a guardian statue and then you can flip it and then deal a thousand damage. That's pretty, pretty broken for dual links if that ever came out. <laughs> the mad dog of darkness. <laughs> That's this is a little too old school. So y'all might not know about this. The mad dog of darkness. <laughs> what does this thing say? He said he used to be a normal dog who played around in the park but was corrupted by the powers of darkness. Mad dog of darkness. <laughs> that goes right over there with that first edition of Jama Yellow. The oh my God, Strike Ninja? Wow, a U-R-I-L-C Strike Ninja. That's what's up, wow. A U-R Strike Ninja, take a look at that. Wow, that is really nice. I am very, very happy. <laughs> a UR Strike Ninja. Wow. And then stumbling. That's nice. But we pulled a UR and a Mad Dog of Darkness. I'm not I'm not gonna be upset about that at all. And we also got a uh, first edition Ojama Yellow. So these are like my highlights of this pack so far. These four cards. I really like these four cards so far.
Thank you for subscribing. <laughs> That's a good thing that people are subscribing. <laughs> and then now we have these two blue eyes white dragon packs and we still have this blister pack left. So let's keep going. Now we already had no idea what we were gonna get in the Invasion of Chaos packs, but with these packs, I have really have no idea. It's an LOB freaking pack. I haven't opened an LOB pack in forever. And then we have these common cards that came rares and common. So Dragon, Dragonic Fireball, this bug guy. Let's see anything interesting in here. Oh no, gift exchange. Ah, that's going right here. Damn. Have y'all seen my previous video about the worst Christmas gift I've ever received? Especially Yu-Gi-Oh related. I might link it in this video. That is uh, <laughs> a hilarious card that you would, uh, you wouldn't expect a terrible story to come from that. But yeah, a bad story was had by y'all. <laughs> so here we go. A Legend of Blue Eyes Dank Classic Pack. Take, take some time to rein this in. It takes some time to enjoy this. This is a vintage Blue Eyes White Dragon pack. This is the pack that started it all. If it wasn't for this pack, you might not be in it, my boy. You might not be in the game. So give honor and homage to the ancient powers of the Blue Eyes White Dragon LOB pack. And we shall see what we pull from its insides. I shall shuffle these legendary OG cards. I'll shuffle them up. Get them nice and shuffled. And then I'll get my flip on. Let's get the flips going. Let's get the flips going. All right, first flip. Trap hole. Wow. Is this an SR? Wow. LOB SR trap hole. Damn. This is fucking vintage. Oh my God. Wow, look at that. That is fantastic. So in case you don't know what this does, if your opponent normal summons a monster, you can activate this card and you just destroy the monster. Um, but it does not work on special summon cards. So this is insane. A super rare trap hole. Let me just... Mm, mm, mm. Now that's nostalgia, boy. That, that is nostalgia right there. That's our trap hole. Okay, so let's open up another one. <laughs> Was this? This is like the guy that you use, I think, to fuse to make flame swordsmen. What is this? <laughs> some fusion, some rare. What is this? Oh, some, some other <laughs> common card. What is this? Book of Secret Arts. Oh, some other common card. Some other common card. Man, these LOG packs really, LOB packs really sucked. Man, I feel sorry for you if you opened up the LOB pack back in the day and was expecting like something real dank and you didn't get anything with these. But your boy got this. Trap hole, super rare trap hole. That is, that is nice. That's, that's worth, uh, that was actually worth it. That was worth the price of admission. I don't even care how much it's actually worth, but that was that was worth it. That was worth that pack to me. These things are fucking impossible. Finally, we got the pack open. Jeez, it took two years, but we got it. Here's the LOB pack. Here's our stack of commons and rares. It looks like they're spicing it up. I got a little preview, a little sneak preview. Got a little pendulum action. Oh, Jane, look at that. That's nice. Okay, that's going right here. Jane, what else we got? We're getting a lot of these and a lot of those, whatever, wherever they come from. Oh, Primal Cry. Some of you guys like that. Put it right there. <laughs> Mild turkey. It's a 
it's a it's a turkey monster. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> you're ru you're ruining everything. <laughs> what what's our next idea for a monster? Why not a turkey? Johnson? Yes. You're getting a fucking promotion. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Exactly like that. That's exactly how it happened. That's exactly how it happened. Johnson got a promotion and then he made dual links. That's how it happened. All right, so here we go. Let's start flipping these over. Giant Soldier of Stone. No way. No fucking way. An L.O.B. Head of the Forbidden One. Did I say that earlier in the video? I'm saving the Legend of Blue Eyes because I want to open up my dank Exodia piece. Oh my God, an L.O.B. What? What? An L.O.B. Exodia head? Oh my god. Wow. LOB Exodia head. LOB trap hole. Fucking strike ninja. Wow. These cards like defined like my old school Yu Gi Oh experience. And I pulled them out of a fucking pack. Wow. God damn. Wow. Look. Look at that. Oh my god, the camera just the camera just freaked out because it was too epic. Wow, that is damn. I am highly impressed. Wow. I'm blown away. Giant Soldier of Stone. That goes here too. Wow. What else is in these packs? We gotta put we gotta put you aside, but we can't we but we can't take you off camera view. These other cards can go off view now. Jesus Christ, that was wow, that was fantastic. What other mysteries? <laughs> this dissolver rock. Other okay, now we're getting back into the jank. <laughs> I cannot believe we pulled ahead of fucking Exodia. Wow. That is fucking sick. An LOB head of Exodia. Nah me. Alright, so you know what's left now. We gotta pull that relinquished out of this, out of these two packs. Make everybody disgusted at this point. If you're, if you got absolutely disgusted when I pull that LOB Exodia head out, or you was absolutely delighted when the LOB Exodia head came out, there's only one thing you can do for those emotions: crush that motherfucking like button. <laughs> Okay, look, we've got two dank packs. We've got two dank packs here. I'm excited. We got the luck of Exodia the Forbidden One. L-O-B fucking Exodia the Forbidden One. We're gonna open up that dank relinquish right now. Everybody else is paying a couple bucks for it. We're paying four bucks for it. We don't even know how much, we don't even know how much it costs. We don't even know what the value is, my boys. We shuffle it up for good luck. Shuffle, shuffle. Here we go. Let's start flipping. Card flip. Crystal Beast, Sapphire, Pegasus. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. Flip. Ancient Gear Golem. <laughs> That's going over here. There's a little pile. Flip. <laughs> Vortex Trooper. Nani. Is this a dual links pack? Flip. What is this? Ojama Mass Elimination? Yeah, Ojama Missimulation. That is weird. I, <laughs> wow. And a Rainbow Dragon, a common Rainbow Dragon. That is not as pretty as the secrets and ultras and ghosts that we used to get back in the day. But that is what we got. Z's. An Ancient Gear Golem. Okay. We can still get the suck though. 
Let's keep digging deep. It's the final pack, my boy. It's the final pack. We, it's all on this pack. It's all or nothing. It's all or nothing. Right here, right now. Here we go. Come on. Time to unleash the ultimate powers of the suck. Release him from the pack. Make all viewers salty. All right. Here we go. Shuffled it up. Moved him around. I'm flipping the first card. Flip. What? What is this? Illusionist, faceless magician. Wow, they actually gave it a card. The illusionist, faceless magician. Wow. That's actually insane. They actually gave this like an effect now. Dang, that does a lot for relinquished and eyes restrict monsters, but let's keep going. What? What is this? Ancient Gear Megaton Golem. And it's a it's a fusion. But unfortunately, it's not the, the dank beast we were looking for, but it's but it's okay looking in conditions. Thank you for the sub. Well, so now we got this dank ancient gear golem. We got to keep flipping, see what else we got in here. <laughs> A perfect ultimate great moth. <laughs> An ancient gear golem. And then what is this? Another sapphire pegasus. So not overall, to be honest, this was not that bad. This was not that bad at all. I have... I don't think I ever have pulled an Exodia head out of a LOB pack, but that is pretty damn dank. This is this is pretty sweet. I'm pretty happy about this. This is a really nice little pool right here. A LOB Exodia head, a LOB trap hole, this ancient gear beast, and a strike ninja. These these three nostalgic beasts are ridiculous. And then this new card that I received, which is like a play on some old school stuff that I used to know back in the day but it's like new age. It's like the perfect packs for me, perfect packs for me. Let me know what you think about this whole unboxing or unpacking or whatever you might want to call it. And let me know um, if you guys have pulled any recent ancient legends from LOB or uh, Invasion of Chaos, my boys. But as always, keep it dank.